Hello, Tim from Fairplay now on the 3rd of March 2022. So, had a couple of days off and I'm uh, feeling a lot better now on the mend, although still not totally 100%, but uh, there you go. All the signs of the actual illness is gone. I'm just uh, a bit washed out, that's all it is. But uh, more than able to do a video today, so here I am. And yeah, all I've been doing the last couple of days is vegging out, switching off from all the stuff I normally talk about and watching just various kind of ghost stories and things like that on uh, YouTube, etc. And um, not really paying much attention to the stuff I normally pay attention to very much at all, but one thing, one big elephant in the room that uh, I haven't missed and most other people in the world do seem to be missing is, well, I'm sure you can pretty much guess what I'm talking about. It's the various documents being released by a company starting with PH and which is highly sort of uh, relevatory isn't it uh, kind of giving away a lot of stuff that no doubt a lot of people would really rather you didn't know and you can't do it you can't help but wonder if the whole thing that everybody is paying attention to right now is kind of designed by the powers that shouldn't be to uh, distract you from, as I say, the big fat elephant in the room. And you can kind of tell it's an agenda. I saw a very interesting Hugo Talks video, which is actually on YouTube, so I'll leave a link to it in the description box and comment section below. Uh, but he was saying how all the usual suspects, I'm talking about politicians and celebrities and all the rest of them are kind of getting behind the whole sort of Russia-Ukraine thing and really vir yeah, doing all their virtue signaling and then you've got people, members of the public or off-license owners pouring Russian vodka down drains and all of this kind of thing and what does that remind you of? Well, I hardly need remind you, do I really? It reminds me of uh, when people were absolutely going crazy about you having to wear that. When people were at going absolutely crazy about how you must have certain other things uh, done to you. And then you had the whole BLM thing, all very reminiscent. And you can kind of tell it's an agenda just because of that, can't you? Uh, not to mention the timing of it is highly suspicious as well. So, and if you think it's too far-fetched to think, well, uh, would they really sort of have people killed over here to um, detract your, or deflect your attention away from the fact that other people are dying over there? Uh, well, you haven't been paying attention, have you? Because that is exactly what the powers that shouldn't be are very fond of doing and are, are very good at doing when they've got things they need to cover up. So I can't help but thinking that just as people should be taking notice of the whole documents thing, their attention is distracted elsewhere. Um, I have seen that, that all sorts of court cases are coming up now and being won. Apparently the Navy SEALs have won a case in the States where uh, they don't have to obey or partake in Joe Biden's mandate after all. And I think there's been a few other cases like that around the world being won. Uh, which is meaning that people won't be lo losing their jobs where they've even where they've got particularly rabid leadership 
wanting them to obey these mandates. And I've even seen France is dropping uh, all of their, uh, or most of their restrictions, including mandated um, treatments and the passports. So hopefully everybody, not just a portion of the French population will soon be able to go back into and enjoy uh, indoor non-essential facilities like restaurants and uh, bars and all the rest of it. Uh, so that is something I've seen. And again, um, why is this happening? Is it because of these documents they now know they haven't got a leg to stand on and they're just desperate to sweep everything under the carpet and just sort of get your attention away from where it should be and over to where really it doesn't need to be because again I think in this Hugo Talks video uh, this war has been going on and on and off um, for seven years and it's only now that they want you to pay attention to it so that's a bit uh, suspect and there's wars here there and everywhere else going on so why aren't we paying attention to that so yeah you know I think um, it really is looking like agendas being worked on but hopefully it's not going to last long and people's attention will be sort of brought back to where they really need to be. And I think there is just going to be so much stuff coming out that they're just not, they're going to get to a stage where they can't hide it anymore, no matter what they do. So I think that time is going to be coming up, but that's just what I think and uh, who knows what will happen. So just a few thoughts there for you today. I'll be back tomorrow. Tim from Fairplay now, thanks for watching.